joined now by head coach Darren Schoenreich. One of those uh, strange games today, Coach, uh, kind of like yesterday, a low scoring to the first half of the game. Then Kent State's offense really got rolling uh, the difference from yesterday. Your offense couldn't get rolling. She strung some hits together here and there, just couldn't get the big hits really to drive and run today. Yeah, Williams is really tough. And, and when he, he pitches down the zone, and he doesn't, you know, he doesn't walk people, so he, he eliminates the freebies from the mound and you know, forces you to get hits. But I thought we barreled some balls up early, and I felt good about some of our bats early. And, you know, it, uh, Eric was cruising along there and, and just ran into a little trouble. Yeah. And, you know, when you get down two to one uh, with, the, with as much as that guy was dominating, it felt like more to our offense. So, uh, but you know, the bottom line is their their guy their their guy with command in the zone. And you know, John had a tough day in uh, command the strike zone, making quality pitches. Uh, Kids State just uh, they just hit the ball well today. Eric uh, went with five and two thirds of a perfect game and the two out walk. Then the home run, then the, the real trouble he ran into. He could have gotten away with that. The real trouble came in the seventh. Yeah, the seventh, they got the two lead up. They got both the first two guys on, and we like to go to the pin. And, and uh, you know, they, they came up with a big hit, then they stretched it out to four to one. And then, it, you know, then it felt like, man, we're, we're, you know, we're facing a really uphill battle. So I thought, you know, I thought the, the, the key offensive momentum shift inning was uh, we came back in the dugout uh, two to one, and mm -hmm. then we had two call thirds right away. So he, Williams, Grabbed that moment right there and stuffed us in the in an answer back inning, and that was a, that was the difference. Uh, tomorrow going to be a key game, obviously trying to win the series, but really the the bullpen is going to be bang to five tomorrow. The reason I say that Kent State now the first two games and the first five innings of each game have managed one run. Fifteen of sixteen runs have come from the sixth inning on. So you're in a tight ball game tomorrow. Uh, you'll need that bullpen to step up tomorrow. You'll need your offense to get going, but. Uh, it, it's probably what we thought would be the rubber game. No one's naive coming into the series thinking it's going to be a sweep by the, e either way. We probably figured it'd come down to Sunday in a rubber game. Yeah, you know, I, I felt like uh, uh, we, we got the starting pitching today mm -hmm. to do it. And, 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 you know, the, the, the bullpen, the freebies you give up in the bullpen are magnified. And, and, uh, and then, you know, come, they, they, they attacked our bullpen today. And they, you know, with stretching out the lead, it kept their bullpen out of the equation. I imagine you'll feel pretty good with Alex. Uh, he's still going to go to hell for you tomorrow. Yeah, Alex is fine, and, and uh, we look to him. If, he, if he's on his game, I think he can he can be very effective against them. We got to continue to defend. I thought defensively, we made some plays today and played a, played a clean game. We just got to battle a little bit more to play. All right.